Here we go. I don't know how well this is going to come up. It doesn't have a lot of zoom on that one. Alright, so here we go. So here's a company uh, repairs photocopiers, right? For these three, these three uh, cities. So Gaspar, Parberry, and Nelton. Okay? And uh, they want you to draw a sketch to show where a company should locate its office so that it is the same distance from each city. Right? So right in the middle, right? So you're thinking somewhere in here, right? So you want it to be the same distance from each city. Right off the first corner. Okay? Yeah? Right off the first corner, this one. Well, that's a little closer. So for, for, one, for one thing, let's think about it for a second. Why would a company want to be the same distance from each city? Think, have, has anybody been to like Wyoming or Montana? Montana. Uh, Alaska. Maybe it's Alaska. 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 Montana. Those those states. When you get outside the cities, right? You'll have a city here and a city here, and then you have like nothing. Yeah. Right. So, so think of it like that. Think of it as as more like there's a city there. It's not like here where. Every, this is a huge monopoly, uh, megalopolis, is what this is called, where you have Tacoma, Auburn, Federal Way, SeaTac, you know what I'm saying, Britain. They're all, they're all tied together. There's no really, nowhere where there's not a city until you go to Eastern Washington, right? So, or we can think of Eastern Washington, I guess, in that aspect, okay? So what we're thinking is, hey, since we have these three cities, if we put a hub in the middle, then people from each city should be able to get to us easily, right? Mm -hmm. So we want to think about what's the best way to find the hub in the center of a city, right? To, to find it so that, so that uh, all three points are the same distance. Now, if we think about that, now I'm going to turn this thing around. Okay. And I want you to kind of think about that without looking at the city, but to look at, to look at, huh? I know. The rivers will, yeah. So I'm going to hit the white today. So I'm going to kind of do a, so Gaspar, okay, and then Arbery, right? And then notice how Nalton isn't straight down, it's a little bit over, right? Does that make sense? So you have this Harberry, Nalton, and uh, what's this, Gaspar, all right? And so you have this triangle. Oops. There we go. All right. We have this triangle. Now, we have those two ideas, right? We have the idea of an end center, right? How do we make the end center? Do you remember? Yeah. So, if we, and this is an obtuse triangle, right? So it's slightly obtuse. So if we drew the end center, it would be uh, perpendicular bisectors, right? So this would be up. Oh, no, no, perpendicular, my bad. Perpendicular bisectors would be, uh, sorry, there we go. And so there, that would be a perpendicular bisectors, and that would be the circumcenter, correct? So there, there's a circle, right, that goes through, and that's the center of the circle, right? But we know that this city, this city, and this city is, would be the same distance from that point, 
Does that make sense? And that would be what we call the circumcenter. And it asked for a way to draw a place that was the same distance from each. So to me, that would be the way to go, right? Does that make sense? So a circumcenter, there is the same distance from here, from here, from here. Okay? But, but, we have this same, well, we'll do it in here. Okay, so we have the same idea, except, remember if we do an in center, it cuts this in half, cuts this in half, cuts this in half, and there's your in center. Right? Now, the in center is not the same distance from each city, is it? It's the same distance from the road. Right? So the in center is the same distance from here, from here, from here. Right? But it's not the same distance from the city. But why would the in center maybe be a better idea than the circumcenter, which is the same distance? Why would you think? So let's take a let's take another look over here. Okay. Try to get a zoom in. I'm going to jump it up so I can get a little bit better zoom. Okay. Um, let's talk about this. Now that circumcenter is going to be somewhere around here, right? That end center is going to be somewhere around here. Does that make sense? Why would this one, why would this dot, we shouldn't do this, but I'm going to. I'll clean it later. Okay. <laughs> now, why would that dot be better than that one? Because it's farther away from Harper. Yeah, it'd be farther away from Harper. And it wouldn't be every it, it looks like it's closer to Harbor, isn't it? Because it is. No, we're I was talking about the red line. The red oh, the red line. Yeah, it'd yeah. be farther than from Harbor. Why would it be farther? Because you can just tell it's farther. <laughs> <laughs> no, they're all the same distance. Remember, they're all the same distance as the crow flies. But, how do you get to the business? Do you fly there? Drive. You drive. So that means to get there, we have to go down here and over to here. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. And that seems a little longer than down and over to here, right? And then if we're going from this direction down and over to here, and then we're going from this direction, we're going up and over to here. So if they want to be the same distance, now we might not do the exact end center, but at least the end center might give us a closer point so that we can actually go, okay, this one will be, say, we wanted to get it to where this one's, say, seven and a half miles. Seven and a half miles, seven and a half miles on the road. Versus ten miles, ten miles, ten miles in the air. Or even, or better yet, five miles. Even if this is shorter, five miles, five miles, and five miles in the air, when you go on the road... This could be three miles, right? Or it will never get shorter, I guess. <laughs> it will get six miles, and then this would be ten miles, and this could be nine miles. Does that make sense? So it will never get shorter than the way you fly. I mean, that's impossible, right? Because that's the shortest distance. It's a straight line. But the road, do you see how taking into effect the roads might give you a different answer where the 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 circumcenter is the best way to go about it as far as for making something the same distance from every point of the triangle that's how we use triangulation to figure